So, this is Once Human. New survival game that's just come out. MMO survival game. There's a lot of grind to it. A lot of story. But basically, we've woken up in a crazy world filled with rifts to the upside down. So, we've got to get out of here and go set up our base and figure out what's happening. Because we were once human, but now we're a little bit different. Let's get the code over here. I think it's on this guy. Or is it uh, up here? I should probably hear it is on the Nemo. So the code, update the code, is 0728. I'm going to try and survive. But it is pretty wild. Played a little bit of it. There's a little bit of PvP. Mostly PvE, I think, but. I want to see what the dungeons are like, so we'll try and get to that. Okay, let's get some weapons. And these are the enemies. This is a light one. Let's take some boiled water from that guy. I don't think I should probably drink it. World has these are deviants. So they Stardust. If the conditions are right, oh, we got a hat. That's good. Might even be able to use Stardust to your and advantage. Games reached. Now we need to go back through here and go this way through these portals. So it's pretty wild. Let's get out of here. Set up our base. Get started. Get some resources together. Build our base. Get some upgrades so we can survive against these threats. Some food and water. Get some of this dirty water and boil it up. There we go. Get some copper. Let's make some weapons. Now we can construct our fire. Here's our temporary camp. All right. Here we go. Equip is primary, so now we've got our weapon and we need to make some arrows as well. So let's make a couple of arrows here. There we go. I haven't put it on. Where is it? So if we go to chest, we actually have a vest, so we can equip that now. The point is, I guess, to um, craft everything from. So it's like your. Here we go. Nice work. There we go, we got our base down. We're going to operate from this, and so we'll store all our extra gear, we'll have all our crafting stations for everything here. Basically, everything's going to operate from this. Okay, press tab to open the function wheel and press, ca press cradle. So we enter the medics mode. This is like blueprint system. Um, okay, so we need smelting, I think. I think we need disassembly techniques too. Now we can smelt down our ores. Break down extra components we get. Copper with the charcoal, so grab our charcoal. And now we can make some copper ingots. So, yeah, as you can see, all your survival basics. Let's get to it. Let's get some action happening. Okay, so we press this. We can switch to our different weapons. Okay, here we go. Now we get to explore. And now we have to go and actually get some stuff going. So hopefully, this is where it's going to get interesting for us. Go back to the upside down. Oh, we got some chests here to loot. Some shots to miss. Alright, so we have a waypoint over this way. I think we can ignore these guys. We're looking for a mystical crate. And we're going to a monolith ruin. Here we go. Let's get these looty booties. Some more arrows back. There's an alarm clock. 
I want to get some pants and a shirt. May as well start getting our farm on. I reckon we're going to need a lot of these resources, so anything we see on the way, like a deer or something, I think we should start farming. Okay, so we want to craft a weapon. That's the blueprint she gave us, I'm thinking. Maybe we actually craft it in here. Oh, here we go. It's actually in there. That makes sense. That's nice. All right, there we go. We got ourselves our first gun. My guy is really low on stem because he's dehydrated. So we've got food and water as well. You know, all the basic supplies, survival stuff. And we've got some boiled water here, so we'll drink that. Um, it should be on our hot bar, isn't it? Yeah, so we're low on stem because we need a drink. In this house is going to be this uh, mystical chest. So let's get that quest going real quick while we're here. So we're here already, right next to it. Let's see if we can get any cool looking loot, armors and stuff. Right on it, right? It's kind of like behind us, I think. It's on the roof. Oh, it doesn't show the location, but it is on the roof. Okay. Hey, let's go. What's this? Is this it? It's a weapons crate. Ooh. Okay, we found the weapons crate. Let's check on the roof here. Oh, this looks like what we're after. There we go. That's the second. Look at this. We found our mystical crate. Oh, there we are. Now we've got our motorbike. We are looking good. Let's get to it. Go get our first boss done. Bosses might actually, like, you know, have a bit of challenge. You actually have to pay attention. Hopefully we're prepared enough. Let's start using melee more. There's a big fella. Speaking of. Actually, we're getting low. Are we? Oh, you, you see that bar? Our health bar has a certain amount of limit now. We've been in this zone for longer than we can sort of afford to be at the level that we're at. So we need to upgrade our armor to stay in these zones longer. Through this way, I'm thinking. There we go. So we need to activate this. I don't know exactly what this does, but we're going to find out. Rift Beacon. Oh, this is the, our first dungeon, maybe. There he is. He's taking down. He's a big fella. A big gun. Cover. Does that take... Can we see if he takes increased damage from anywhere? Well, it was his head, obviously. We're getting bigger hit markers, but... We do have a grenade too, I feel like we should try using that on him. Get on to a different phase. Oh yeah, okay, he's doing some different stuff, that's good. Hopefully we've got enough ammo. 72 shots. Oh, we should probably craft us some more ammo before this, to be honest. Uh, probably gonna run out of ammo, which is gonna be very interesting. Here we go, we pushed him to the next phase. That sounds scary. What are these? He's got some ads. Maybe they'll drop us some ammo if we're lucky. Let's uh, melee these guys actually. And then see if they drop us some refills. Yeah. Miss a good boss fight. Do we need to close that rift? I'm thinking. We can use the barrels and stuff, I guess, to damage the boss too. So if we grab this and then we throw it at the boss. Yeah, that's what we need to do. If we take this pill, it might actually give us more health too, by the way. There we go. Our health is way up now because we, we were getting that um, debuff. We've been in this dark stuff for too long. Okay, here we go. We've got some more explosives. Let's hit him with it. 
There we go. That's how we do it. Yeah, so that's the way. Switching to melee weapon. Okay. Do we still have our bow? I need to check if we still have our bow. This is doing pretty good damage, actually. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is sick. This is actually so sick. I um, really underestimated. I didn't think like we'd need a prep to go in here. Can we even melee this guy? Let's find out, I guess. We can. Okay. This might nearly be viable until he just one taps us, I'm thinking. Oh, shh. Okay. Ugh. Let's heal up. Okay, let's get behind him. Oh, he's teleporting. So close. Come on. We got this. Oh, sheesh. We need to heal. We got him. We got him. That was epic, man. Holy. I really like that. Alright. We got another deviant. I guess it was harder because we ran out of stuff. Let's go. We got a recurve bow. Now let's go fix up our base. Upgrade base. There we go. Now I don't feel so naked. Let's get all the walls up on base. Get all the wood. It's pretty good size, I think. Storage. Here we go. Alright. Let's regen our mentality. We need rusted parts, which I think we'll be able to make from our disassembly bench. From all the random stuff. So, disassemble all, and we've got some more rusted parts. Let's go! There we go. Whoops. Alright, garage. Here we go. We are moving up in the world. Oh yeah. So, what can we do on this? Can I fix my bike? Let's see. Basic parts. Durability. We can repair. We need 9 copper and 10 metal scraps. Hold to confirm. There we go. Our bike is back in accident. Can we make a garage door? Probably have to unlock it. So what I'll do... I'll put the windows in later. For now, let's just get this bad boy boxed up. Um, it's not... Oh, we had it? No, it rotate doesn't work either. So what I'm thinking is... We move this. Just for now. And we move this. Put them inside, and then what I'm going to do is we demolish that, move this. For now, let's just get this thing sealed up and looking like an actual home. Now we need to make doors, interior attachments. There's our wood door. Boom. Boom. Gotta separate our garage. Overlaps with the building. No. Can't live in a box. We've gotta make some slope ceilings. It's looking like a barn. The barn's nearly done. Enter flight mode. Enter flight mode? That's wild. Oh wow, okay. We can just enter a mode where we can fly around to build. That's huge. Let's go. Sealed in. Alright. Alright, how's our build, chat? How's our build looking? I think it's pretty good. I think that's pretty nice. Oh, she's dark in here now. We actually need some windows. Let's get some windows on quick. Alright, we've got a base. That's the main thing. 
I think I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. So, pretty good day's progress. I'm pretty happy. So, next time we get to a level 11 and we can get some action and fight some people. If you guys did enjoy this video, please take the time to leave a like and subscribe. It really helps me out and I've been live streaming this game daily. We're getting into some PvP now, so if you guys want to catch more, don't forget to catch the streams. Also, use my friend code if you guys want to join the game and I can give you guys a blueprint for a good weapon. You guys are legends. Thanks for watching.